Oh yeah, LDBC. I couldn't wait to sink my teeth into this. I, I, I just couldn't wait. And I'm glad they finally captured this bastard, this dumb looking buffoon ass bastard that you see on the screen. They got him, they got this guy. And it looked like, you know, this is the first time that I'm not upset about police brutality. This is the first time that I'm not upset about police brutality. Oh, I'm not upset about it. And it looked like the cops gave this dude a beating before they took him in. Good. I'm glad. I'm glad you deserve to get beat. You deserve it. That's what this guy deserved. But I'm going to tell you who need to be a part of the interrogation process. And you guys all know where I'm going with this. You guys know exactly where I'm going with this. That's right. Walt Harris need to be a part of the interrogation process. They need to lock dude in there. I'm talking about close the doors, man. Put him and Walt Harris inside of an empty cell. And I mean, let Walt Harris do what he do. You put this guy in so much pain. And I'm talking about you torture this guy and you torture this guy. And you continue to torture until he speak, until he tell you, where is she at? Where is she at? See, no more for playing, man. See, guys like this. See, guys like this. Don't give him no trial because he ain't doing nothing costing the taxpayers money. Uh-uh. Don't give him a fair trial. He don't need a trial. He don't get a trial. He shouldn't deserve a trial. And now you're Haley Blanchard. She didn't get a trial. See, she didn't get a trial. She, she, she didn't get anything. She didn't get any, any recourse before this guy decided to, to just kidnap her and probably savagely did whatever he did to her. You see, chances are, man, when you find the person that abducted you, and you're not there with the person, guys, there's a high percentage that this girl may not be with us anymore. And I tell you what, man, Walt Harris need to be in that interrogation room. They need to do it. They need to, look, bend the rules. They do the, They bend the rules for everything else. They bend the rules for everything else. Hey, they bend the rules when they beat them up. They bent the rules. This guy need to see nothing but pain. That's it. That's all he need to see is pain. Nah, it shouldn't be no try to negotiate with this guy. Don't give him no plea deals. All this guy need to understand is pain, because that's the only thing he ever give out in his whole life is pain. That's it. That's all this guy knows. And, and, and the fact of the matter is, guys, to tell you why people don't mess with the police, you see why nobody really came forward? Y'all see why nobody came forward? You know, to try to collect that reward money? Because, see, the police, they get it wrong. They always tend to get it wrong. All the time. Isn't that something? You got a guy, man, who, you know what, he had a $295,000 bond. Okay? And, of course, I think you only got a bond out with 10% of that. So, of course, he got about, you know, twenty-nine dollars to $30,000 to bond out with. Like, who lets this guy get out on bond? This guy tried to kill somebody. This guy beat down a 77-year-old man in a hotel. Like, beat him down. Tried to kill him. But they let this guy out on bond? Like, come on, man. This, I mean, I, I'm telling you, man, our justice system is evil. You got people doing crime. I, I mean, for doing damn near next to nothing. You got people still in jail for tax evasion. I understand that the government, you know, they they find that they put that high up in their hierarchy. But tax evasion, you're not killing people. Like, a, a person can get more years for tax evasion in some cases than you can murder. Like, this is crazy. If a person have an ounce on them, they can go to jail. If a person carrying an ounce in some states, they can go to jail. But a person can, can, can damn near kill somebody, beat a person one inch of their life and they still get out. A person can go off kidnapping people, harassing people, terrorizing the community. These people, though, they get their pass. They get a free pass out. And it's almost like the, 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 the criminal justice system is designed for the criminals. Like, they, they called it the right name, criminal justice, because it only benefits the damn criminals. Like, you see all these people getting off, man, for all these murders, man. You see all these people getting off, man. Everybody getting off, they're doing little to no time. They're getting slaps on the wrist. Like, folks, this is ridiculous, man. I mean, what, what, what does it take? I mean, I, I, mean I, I hope they don't offer this guy bond this time. This guy got out of jail. They offered him bond, and now look what this guy was able to do. Look what he was able to do. Okay, look. And I blame the criminal justice. I blame the police. I blame law enforcement. I blame the law for this. I blame the law. And this man is in control of his own action, but I blame the law. 
And I'm going to tell you, dude, I ain't got time to argue with none of y'all. I don't care if you see it my way or not. I'm not arguing with none of y'all. This guy need to roast and burn in hell. It, 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 it need to be the end of them. They need to beat him down. They need to keep beating him. You keep beating him until he tell it. Until this man open his mouth, you beat him. You kick him. You stomp him. You tase him. You do whatever you got to do. Whatever you got to do to get the truth out of this dang old... I can't stand this, man. I'm going to tell you why I can't stand this, guys. I'm going to tell you why I can't stand this. I'm sick and tired. I'm sick and tired of the law benefiting people that break the law. This world is bad as aquas, man. This dude savagely attacked this guy. Savage. He savagely attacked him. But see, he'll do a plea deal probably. He'll get some kind of plea deal. Get something. And everybody else that accompanied this guy, every single person that accompanied, they need to go down too. And I want to see, I want to see these people, everybody else that helped them with this, I want them beat down too. I want them beat down like this. For the first time, I am happy about police brutality. 